Yes, yes, y'all, nobody does it better when it comes to entertainment analysis. And trust me on this one, as I have some of the brightest minds the industry has ever produced, who will help me serve it to you as it they ought. Grab yourself a cup of tea and enjoy the ride with me at the delectable Ife Omai and Emerald Emenuga. Looking out for each other. How you guys doing? <laughs> How's it going? I'm blessed, I'm blessed, I'm blessed. Dude, How you it's doing? It's only Wednesday. Yes, it's I'm all. so upset. But the week is Mark, quite fast. I could tell. How? I could tell. You, tell, you could tell, right? Yeah. But like, the week is fast, right? Not fast enough. It should I mean, be Friday. Or well, at least Wednesday. Thursday. No, 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 no. Ah, uh, no, no. You know we are always on the it's same page. It's actually fast. On it's fast. Oh, it's very fast. fast so this enough, week is though. actually like I remember when it was just Sunday and today is Wednesday and I'm like, yay! Oh, so it's so almost Friday. Only Wednesday. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah. <laughs> Anyways, what have you been up to, though? Lacking What's sleep. making you look forward to the weekend? I don't weekend? know. I've just been lacking so much sleep this week. So mm. much sleep. I don't know. Maybe that's why. Are you why. thinking about somebody? Hmm. I'm thinking about money. Money. Yeah, <laughs> that's enough to make Money's... you lose sleep. <laughs> it's enough. <laughs> Trust me. Some of us just sleep through the pain. <laughs> but how do you feel? Yeah, just on that money. You see, Anna, she... your, your, but, your body is dripping diamond. Nobody repeat diamond. <laughs> do, you know, <laughs> do you know what that is? Mm -mm. You don't know that joke? Mm. Oh, it's an inside joke. You didn't get it either, no, obviously. No, don't. You guys don't watch Plus TV, do you? There's something called Plus on the street, and that's like our montage. Mm. Yeah, said by Ungozika. Your body is dripping diamond. <laughs> Alrighty. I'll go check it out. You should. It's going to crack you up, trust me. Yeah. Alrighty. 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 So let's get straight to the business of the day because we have guests lined up. We have like three mm. amazing guests that will Talented be joining us on the show. Actually. And yeah, some of them veterans, some of them have been with veterans, some of them are, you know, the hip hop heads. If you are out there, you really need to watch the show today. And if you're an RB soul lover, then you actually need to be on the show because we have all genres of music, you know, guests from all genres, all spheres of music, you know, coming to entertain us. Are you guys That's ready? That's how we do. Mm -hmm. That's how we vibe. do. And yes, yeah, so moving on to the business of the day, as you know, Barry J, and for those of you who don't know, a little backstory. Once upon a time, there was a record label owner, Kashi, who allegedly committed suicide, surrounded by shady circumstances in Ghana. And the prime suspect was this artist, who was picked up by the Ghanaian police due to their scuffle a few minutes before the alleged suicide. After thorough investigation, Barry J was set free and he has now broken silence since his arrest, releasing CCTV footages, his police reports and legal documents a lot, right? Exonerating him completely. Yes, hence Barry back. The question on a lot of people's mind is, is it safe to say this case is over? say it's over mm. well um barry is saying he's free mm. so we can say it's over no we've never been of the opinion that barry was the you know main yeah i mean guy like who you know, did the it. very did we feel like he did it table, that was what every oh, 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 that was yeah, the yeah, trend yeah, yeah. i'm talking about on this table so oh, okay, yeah. Okay, okay. okay yeah so i'm just talking about the whole thing out mm. there not just yeah. on this table so barry's free but they have okay there was um, a video right uh, CCTV video and mm -hmm. all showing how and uh, like that. the so, time it left the time yeah, yeah. so I actually read the whole document his report the court documents the you know police documents and all of that I can't believe I did all of that yeah I think I think that's the CCTV footage actually playing that's Barry leaving at 12 42 a.m. yeah mm. on the third of um, yeah on 7th of January 2021 and he had jumped after that or yeah ju he, he jumped no, no, after he left 12 53 after mm. he left so Kashi jumped 12 53 so there was a, an 11 minute interval after before. Barry left the building, mm. before Kashi was seen, he wasn't seen jumping, but we, we saw another CCTV footage that showed when landed. Kashi landed. Le yes. Yeah. Very. Oh, you clapping? You're like, did you about me? Hey! Hey, oh, show my show. Uh, oh, my show. Now, nah, that's oh, really? um, another one from the fourth floor. So, apparently, this was when the drama started. This is... Um, 12.40 and then security guys run into the apartment trying to like go find out what exactly what's what going was on. going on in the building then so and then there was another footage that now showed you know when Kashi dropped at um 12.53 but you know you know Twitter have CIA mm. 
Mm. Have you guys seen Twitter CIAs and narrating <laughs> and analyzing the videos mm. and all of that? So I saw a few comments. I didn't want to put it out there because majority of it is that we're in support of Barry is free. The law has said you're free. Mm. But at the end of the day, we must because it's, it's our work. We it's didn't say work. it. Now, so Twitter streets, now they have the opinion that, okay, Barry made a video, <clears throat> right? Now, in the court documents, it was said that Kashi was erratic. Mm. There was a Ghanaian producer in the house. According to police reports, mm. court documents and everything, there was um, a Ghanaian music producer in the house. A female friend of Kashi. Mm -hmm. We don't know whether it's his girlfriend or a female friend. Mm -hmm. You understand? Now... And Barry J, he invited Barry J to come in, come and record because it was with a Ghanaian producer. Mm. So he flew Barry J down to Ghana and then they were recording. Barry J was in a room. They rented three, a, a three bedroom apartment. They didn't say for how long, but they rented a three bedroom apartment for the period of time that they will be there. Apartment? Yeah, it was a three bedroom apartment. Was that, was that not a hotel? Mm. No, that's, that's our apartment. That's how Ghana's, Ga okay. Ghanaians build their apartment. You know these things now. You can rent three bedrooms for like, it's more like um, what you call your service Yeah, I know, I know all of yeah. that. It's just that the setting looked like it was a hotel. Yeah, of course, they have receptions. It's just for you to rent. It's not okay. like it's a residential place that you can come and pay one year. Yeah, yeah. Do you understand? So it's just for you to rent. You want a big space. You don't mm, want a, okay. a one room thing. So um, he invited Barry over. Then the female, according to the report, the female friend ran into the studio where Barry J was recording with a Ghanaian producer. Um, producer to say, oh, Kashi is acting abnormally. Mm. And then Barry went out and tried to quench it and he got violent. Now, he threatened to stab him. He hit him with a WC cover. He punched him and all of that. This is all stated in the report. Mm. But in a video, now I'm talking from Twitter Street now, people are analyzing the video and the events that occurred. And they said there was a, a video where Barry actually posted that the guy was saying, Monife. Yeah. Monife. So for somebody who was erratic, Twitter Street is acting. What point in time? Because they said Barry ran away. That was the video we saw of him exiting the building. And yeah. after he left yeah. that building, he actually made a Snapchat of yeah. his, his face and saying, yeah. oh, my friend, yeah. Me. Yeah. 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 So a lot of people are wondering that, okay, no, Apart from that one that he did, like, look and look at what mm. my friend did to me. A lot of people are also asking that when did Kashi have the time to calm down to be saying Monife while you were making a video and bleeding? That is, he had been erratic towards you. Mm. So at what point was he calm? Mm. At what point did you have to run? Do you understand? Now, these are questions that have been left unanswered. But of course, those but we are know the only... point he ran. We know the... Well, what, yeah, what, what, we know the point that he ran. Like I'm, I'm talking about. Um, but we also Barry saw another now. video that showed, you know, um, Kashi dropping. So his story is corroborated. Do you understand? Oh. So you can't actually. Oh. We actually saw a few minutes after he left, and we saw Kashi drop. Yeah. So but he the, has nothing to do with the drop. Yes, he had nothing to do with the yeah. drug. Now the question is: So, at what point? If Honestly speaking, are saying, this sounds to me like drugs. It could be. This sounds to me like it could proper be. drugs. And you see, with drugs, you can go high. And then you can go low. And then you and can come back up. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can jump. Oh. Okay. Mm. Yeah. So, yeah. So, I mean, I think that's what it is, in my opinion. It, 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 I know a lot of people who know him personally that have been mourning his death in Nigeria. Mm. And it's been really personal for them, very heavy. They're all really sad. He's a really great guy. And yeah, no one has said anything bad about yeah, him. Yeah, nobody has actually said anything bad. And we know for, I don't want to say we know for sure, but it's, almost very obvious that it's not suicide, right? Especially because of all the action that was happening. happening. Right, so already there was a, um, a scene. There was, there was an eyewitness, though, who said they saw him swinging back and forth, acting Do you understand why I think that sounds like I think that's drug. It and like then the police, the Ghanaian police also advised the apartment complex that they should increase the um, balcony level oh. from the waist to the chest level so mm. it's not easy for I, I don't know if you remember when we well. first talked about the story I was telling you that that mm. like two weeks earlier my friend jumped or mm. I mean he fell he off fell the off. balcony oh. from taking Colorado that's what it was, was oh it? wow yes it was drugs wow. and he like when he got um when he got uh better like he said he wanted to pick up his phone 
but then the phone was looking oh, further right. than or I don't know how we calculated. Those are the effects of we drugs. Yeah. No, don't worry, they are seeing things. <laughs> I'm <laughs> seeing things. I swear, but you know, this is somebody that has lived in that apartment for a very long time. Mm. And the balcony is really, really high as well. Do you oh. get what I mean? Like it's really high. So I this to me sounds like drugs. Mm. Wow. I think I think to everyone, but the question is, see, there are a lot of questions that have been left unanswered. I remember when his girlfriend came out to say it was not Barry J. You guys yeah. should stop sending him that threat. I know who did this. I know the exactly. Evil you know person. when I saw when I saw that. You understand? Post. So if that is the case, then it's not a suicide. Somebody did something. Somebody knows something. Why is nobody talking? But who who else was left in this in the apartment after, after Barry, the Barry left? And his um, yeah, friend, the producer and. His female friends. So one they, of should, them, they should, they should, if they should, they should be questioned. Up on his own, one of them pushed him. Or maybe there's another person that is not accounted for that was in the building. Mm, maybe. So why can't the hotel tell? Exactly. And then Twitter streets, they, they know how to analyze these things. So they, they told me about one part that Barry J came out and it was in, in the front parking lot and you could see Barry J coming towards the right and then you could see some other guys going towards the left. Mm -hmm. And I'm wondering, okay, what am I supposed to do with that information? <laughs> who, is the, who is the other guy? <laughs> Maybe that's what they're trying oh, to Oh, that's what they're trying to tell us. Yeah. Okay. But whatever it is, um, you know, her heart goes out to Kashi all the same. May it's oh. perfect, so rest in peace. Yes, the man has been laid to rest, and we just hope he finds peace Very wherever quickly, he is. Too quickly, even. I think that's because he's yeah. Muslim. Yeah, I mean, I respect everyone's culture, but sometimes I feel like, ah, oh, it's so soon. I had a friend that died like that, and we didn't even get to... Before we landed in the city, because it was in a different town, mm. where we landed in the city, yeah, say, it was buried already. Like, but well, I think, I think it's... I don't like the fact that I have to, like... See, I don't want to see. Some people want to see. I don't want to see. Some people need closure. So, yeah, some people. Some people need to see. If not, they won't accept that, that person the person is, is gone. gone. Some people you see some way. family members that will not break down until they see. I'm it telling you, the ground. it now registers that like, yeah, like this okay. person is actually going in. Yes. <laughs> Do you understand? Ah. Yes. Anyways, mm. we need to move on really quickly. Like I told you, we have a lineup of um, you know, um star-studded people in the building yes i need to say that with some attitude you get me <laughs> Alrighty. yeah all right so gambian gambian actress and producer princess shingo has confirmed that she once dated grammy award winner bona boy it will be recalled that bona boy and princess shingo were allegedly dating each other as they were spotted together at an outlet in lagos in 2019. fast forward to 2021 the gambian actress had a video call with bona boy you know a few days after his his win at the grammy sharing the video she wrote when your ex wins a grammy you clout chase on the real though congratulations dami so how hard you worked for this africa for this africa to the world the question here is is it oh, when is it okay to clout chase anytime, i swear like anytime. just do it <laughs> anytime you, you want to clout your chase clout your chase and this chase is a very cloud, good time chase your clout it's <laughs> a very good time for her to actually thank do you this. very much <laughs> do you know and what it, it is if it's, if it's anything i applaud her style Mm. Like she wasn't messing around. Like I'm yeah. not cloud chasing. You know, I'm chasing. Me, you know, cloud chasing, and then you see the caption and it's some nonsense, inspirational thing. Your boobs are out. You know yeah. you have gigantic boobs, mm. and that's the cloud chase where you be like, you know, whoa, is the person who da 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 and the sun and the light. Oh, once upon a time. Da, 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 and I'm once like, upon a time. Like, clear out of this once place, upon a time, I had this come. But now, boy, congrats. Uh. <laughs> um, you know, obviously this man has a type. For goodness oh, sake. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> he has a type. Yes. He has a type down to the heights. And, and like the, the skin the, cut, the, 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 the and down to the everything. past. <laughs> <laughs> down to the, the past, Baba. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah, he has a type. It, it, yeah, he does have a type. But man, the, I don't think this old, you know, Grammy then it's going to be forgotten in a long time. I think we're going to keep talking about it. Yeah, we're going to keep talking about it. I've seen different stories on just Grammy alone. I've seen the one where they came for David Do that he forgot Mother's Day because he was thinking about Grammy. <laughs> Did you people see that thing? When, when it was announced that um, 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 Berna and Whiskey won the Grammy, I, the first thing I posted was, I just hope there's no fight after this whole thing. Mm. Like I was like, Twitter family should calm down. And then I started seeing things like, 
a lot of tweets the video i was like, very happy that the video that. tweeted actually yeah. i was happy the way he tweeted yeah. as well like that was really mature i mean now even though it's banter even though, you know i don't know if it's banter but even if it's fake or whatever or it's just pr i feel like it kind of separates the childishness like it is not about the artist now, yeah every other childishness that's happening is between the fans and they yeah. can do whatever they want to do then we, 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 we really need to move on but re real quickly let's touch on ghana have you seen the war going on in ghana over our grammy wins <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, we love that, and we love the fact that we're even making music in you people's country. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we will be going on a quick music break, and when we return, we have some exciting personalities joining us. Stay with us on Tea Time on Plus TV Africa.